Yo, what's good? Good looking to the Sony Entertainment TV, and today we are going to be fighting the. <clears throat> if they would ever show up. Excuse me, sir, please. The White Jack and Orange Jack. I believe Orange Jack and White Jack Bandits. Um, I don't know if they're going to be any different. Maybe some of them will be carrying those new weapons that dropped. I have to wait for them to show up, apparently. Give me one second. Let me see. Everybody's congregating down here. Are they down here? Hello? Hello? Uh-oh. We don't know where they're at yet. Hold on. I will be back when we find them. Alright. I found them. We have found them. They're right here. They were over here the whole time. I just couldn't see them. I had to leave and re-enter. But I'm coming. Hold on. I'm plumbing. I'm plumbing, boys. Alright, so it looks like they have the white jack helmets on. But I don't... I don't think any of them are necessarily using... Oh, maybe he is. Maybe he is. The orange guy. It looks like he is carrying... Don't Please don't hit me. It looks like he might be carrying that new pistol. I don't know who is blowing up my phone right now. Sorry about that, guys. Um... But it does look like that orange guy. Man, I want to get in there to that orange guy. Alright. Alright, I'm going after the orange guy. Hold on. If he's still alive, he might not be. He's using some kind of new weapon. That might be the Rhea. But it looks like the new weapon. So maybe the orange guys are carrying the new weapons. And the... So he is the leader, so... Um, orange Jack leader... Oh my god, that scared the fuck out of me. I thought they, like... I don't know what I thought for a second there. Hmm. Okay, cool. So it looks like maybe the the guys with the orange ones... Uh, the orange toppers, orange pumpkins, are using the new weapons. Um. Ooh. That guy almost got me. Excuse me. I need to go find these other ones here. It's gonna be a bit of a shorter video, because I think that this is all that I'm doing, is I'm just showing these guys... Maybe I should have done that single player to show them off. Because they are already dead. Um, and I... I don't think I can just leave and come back in. Give me one second. Let me see if I can find some more. Okay, so unfortunately, um, I could not find any more. And when I just come back in, they just automatically die, obviously. So what we're going to do is we're going to go one up here. Um, do I fight the multiplayer? Let me... I'm going to go into single-player mode. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to go into single-player mode. Um, yeah. Alright, so we're going to go into single-player mode so we can fight these guys ourselves. Um, and not have to worry about everybody else that's here. Let's try and get into these courts up here so that way we can kind of separate them from the rest of the zombies. Um, and we can get a good look at them. I already did this in the other video when I did the Halloween event video. But I figured I would make a video just specifically for these enemies here. Um, wow, they are fast as fuck, aren't they? Let's see if we can... Okay, we did get some to spawn in here. Let me get rid of that exploder guy. So these guys are pretty dope. Um, if you haven't seen my last video or you didn't watch far enough to get to these guys. Because... I'm going to be honest, I talk a lot. <laughs> but um, they're super quick, as you can see. Um, they do about 300, maybe 350 damage, somewhere around there. Um, obviously, the stuff hasn't come out yet. Um, and when it comes out, I will make a video on it. Like when it's on the, the fandom or whatever, the, the wiki. But it's not currently on there, so I'm just going off of what I know. They do about 300 damage per hit. I would have to say they probably have about... I'm going to get this wrong, but... 30, 40,000 health. Because um, it feels like it's about a, about a quarter of an FBT, which has about 200,000 health. So, And the... the Slendermen have about 30,000 health as well. So, just going off of tradition, I would assume that these guys uh, do a, they have about 30 to 40,000 health. Um, 
and they do about 300 to 350 damage. Um, again, I will make a video whenever the stats actually do come out. And they're, they're super quick, boy. They do not play around. They don't give you any rest time, pretty much. I mean, it looks like I can outwalk them, but I don't want to take that chance every single time because, you know, if you have to turn or something like that, you could get you could wind up getting caught up in the business. Um, obviously, I will be playing a lot of this event with Brandon. Um, we're going to have a great time. We're going to be doing DF2 as well. They released a unique... You know, I won't say anything. I won't say anything because I'm going to make a video about it. But just know, I'm actually... I haven't seen exactly what the event is for DF2. I've read a little bit about it um, on the Discord. But, like, I haven't actually seen what the new stuff is and, like, if it does, you know. I just haven't seen it. We'll just, we'll just leave it at that. I won't add anything else. But, um... Yeah, I'm super pumped for it. For DF2. They got all kinds of new stuff in there as well. So, it, it, there's going to be a lot of content creation. Because I want to get a lot of Halloween stuff out. You know what I'm saying? Obviously, I got I got to do these bosses. And uh, unfortunately, the boss hunts will be limited. Because only the Halloween bosses are going to spawn. And I don't... Like, it's one thing if I upload boss hunts and it's like, Oh, I did two Flaming Titans this day on this one. And like a bunch of other stuff. And then next week another one uploads where i'm doing you know two flaming titans and a bunch of other stuff like that's one thing but like every boss hunt i upload to be like these guys or something like that it would get pretty boring um and a lot of the like a big reason why i would watch boss hunts or i feel like other people watch boss hunts is to like watch the fight watch the tactics and then watch the loot but if the loot's not gonna if the loot's just gonna be the 2022 trick-or-treat then I don't know. I feel like I'm going to put the boss hunts on hold for now and then just focus on the Road to 325, um, Hardcore, DF2, um, and then obviously the Halloween special that that's going to be coming out. Um, if you're watching to this point, um, just know that I got some stuff planned for the Halloween special. Uh, it's going to be it's going to be fun gonna be it's gonna be fun i'm gonna have fun with it i hope you guys enjoy the video when you watch it because that's why i create content i create content for people to enjoy it and i have one all the way down there in the bottom left Fuck. so i don't have anything else in my inventory by the way guys um except pumpkin heads so i have right now 23 of those pumpkin heads i still have more to get um because obviously we're gonna be opening those i might even give some away just because you know some people might not have gotten around to getting a bunch of the pumpkin heads and stuff so uh and i obviously i'll be making videos on the new weapons and everything like that so it should be it should be good we got a lot of good content coming um as long as i can stay on top of everything and uh yeah it's gonna be fun i'm gonna enjoy this event and everything that comes with it. I can't wait to actually be able to break down how much damage the new guns do and everything like that and get my hands on one of those, uh, get my little paws on one of those implants. I don't know if I'm going to get the golden implant or if I'm going to get the white implant, but I'm going to get one of them. That's for sure. That's a fucking fact, Jack. Okay. So that was the, oh, I got a new message. Who messaged me? Congratulations from the help bot. Uh-oh. Let's see what we did. I don't know what that said. Um, these guys, these people here, you still have trades that you can accept. Um, oh, it's dry truffles and whiskey. $120,000. That's actually not bad. $120,000. I'll take that for sure. For sure, my guy. So I'm already rocking uh, 23 of these. I got plenty more to go. Um, that was the bandits, the whitehead and orange head bandits, as well as the, uh, pumpkin tendrils. Um, they're cool. They're all cool. I, I, I really enjoy the, the, the new, uh, pumpkin tendril bosses. They're super dope. Um, if you're a lower level player, the pumpkin head zombies are pretty cool. Stay away from them though. They do explode. And then the werewoos, whatever they call them. What the fuck do they call them? Yeah, werewoo. <laughs> Oops, I clicked on the wrong thing. 
Um, they're pretty cool too. They're pretty fast. I don't know why they have them like in this. You can see the street background on it, even though you don't. I don't think you really find them there. I haven't found them there. I've only found them in uh, the wasteland. But hey, maybe at one point you could find them there, and that's why they have the street background for it. But all that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully, you enjoyed the video. And if you did, if you're looking forward to the to the new content. Uh, be sure to definitely hit the like button, subscribe button, and share button. Definitely leave a comment down below letting me know what you want to see next and what you thought of the video. And definitely turn on post notifications so you get notified every time I upload a video because you're not going to miss what is next. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, let's get it on with this Halloween.